Yo, what up, y'all? Hola, todos. We here in my house. Estamos aquí en mi casa. Look what I'm doing, y'all. We here in the hacienda. Boom! Estoy hacienda, uh, hold up, the things. Estoy hacienda huevos. I'm making some eggs, some bacon. I'm about to get the sausages out. I got some frijoles aquí. You know what I mean? Hold on, let me get the sausages out right here. Are you trying something? Maybe that's what you're talking about. Go out, make some of these and some turkey bacon. I mean, we're doing a little bit of everything today, y'all. It's almost like seeing them poquito de todo. Oh, flip right. Alright, this ain't a perfect, this ain't a perfect omelet. But anyway, y'all, so basically what I'm gonna be doing today, getting some willies in the streets. I got this little uh, mini GoPro to put on my head, head strap. I wanna practice some of the combos that I was doing before, but I wanna, you know, perfect them this time because I was doing them decent, but I wanna get them perfect every time, nice and smooth, without crashing, you know what I mean? Uh, so I'm gonna practice those on a little XR70. You know, and warm up to that bike and then, you know, do it on the big bike. So today we're on a 70 and, uh, yeah, just riding around my neighborhood, fooling around a little bit, but mostly you're trying to get some combos down, trying to get my, uh, turns better. You know what I mean? I want to get consistent hitting left turns, right turns, staying in a willy, you know, stuff like that. Voy a hacer cabajitos ahoy mi barrio y voy a hacer video con esto GoPro, mi cabeza, esto cámara y voy a practicar mis trucos, las cosas que yo hacer encima de la motocicleta. Cuando estoy en un cabajito. Tengo algo que yo estaba practicando, pero no tengo perfecto ya. Y quiero uh, practicarlos sin caídas. Y uh, hacer algo más, you know, un poquito divertido en mi barrio también. Quiero hacer los cabajitos en las curvas también. Girando a la derecha o izquierda, pero sigue en un cabajito sin, you know, boom, los dos métricos. Entonces, eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Voy a terminar esta comida ya. Y comer y luego, boom, voy a salir de mi casa, okay? I'm gonna go ahead and finish making this food. Finish eating it, and then we're gonna take off in front of my house and, uh, you know, go on this little journey with me, y'all. Let's get it. Oh, yeah, and I forgot to tell y'all, too, that I got some new camera gear. Tengo uh, nuevos cosas para mi camera que viene en mi uh, correo muy pronto. They're coming in the mail soon, y'all. I got this gimbal. This is the uh, Zion Weeble S. This is a gimbal. Basically, you turn the uh, camera all the way around different angles, and it uh, stays still. The camera doesn't move, but everything else moves around it, you know what I mean? If you guys don't know what it is. Uh, esto es un uh, gimbal que tú gira todo uh, que esas cosas aquí y la cámara sigues en la mitad si entiendes haces esto y luego la cámara no gires eh, luego yo compraré esto también un small rig una casa por mi cámara I bought this little case for my camera that way you know because I'm always doing things outside and things with motorcycles and bikes and all this stuff so I'd rather my camera be a little bit more protected than you know nothing so I figured it's something you know so I got that uh, I got some lenses. These are Vivitar, you know, Series 1. These are like the lens filters or whatever, the UV and all that. That way, uh, you know, if, it, if I'm outside, a couple of my old videos, you can see where I'm outside and it's really sunny or whatever, and then the image will be overexposed. It'll be too much light. Everything will be like really, really white, really bright, and you can't really see anything too clear. That's when you go ahead and throw on one of these, you know, darker tint lenses, and it's kind of like putting sun sunglasses on, you know what I mean? And uh, makes everything look way nicer. Then I got this lens, and this is going to be one of the biggest differences right here. I got this lens, this is an 11 by 22 uh, Canon. It's got a built-in stabilizer, the uh, image stabilizer, and it's a wide angle. The one I got now is a 15-45. This is a 11 millimeter by uh, 22 millimeter, so I can still be able to zoom in and everything, but it's going to be wider, and you'll be able to see more, you know what I mean? I like the wider angles, because I feel like, like you can feel like you're really there with me, you know what I mean, when I'm taking the video. You know, opposed to, you know, how my journal all the way zoomed in. You're all up close to my face. But anyway, y'all, I'm done chilling. I'm going to go ahead right now and uh, get ready. Check out the style, yo. Killing them. All right, y'all, we out here in the streets. I'm going to get warm up a little bit first, all right? It's one of the first days where it ain't 115 degrees outside. Bike up and warm myself up. <laughs> My pants are slippery on this seat, yo.
police don't run down on me today like they did last couple times. That turn for a while now. You're yeah, double, double apex. y'all i'm gonna practice some of the combos right now voy a practicar uno de mis uh trucos quiero mejorar en esta cosa solo es solo una cosa que quiero practicar you know i'm already comfortable in that position standing on top of the seat in the willy but i want to get real 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 like perfect you know what i mean i want to get like flawless on that seat yo you know practice makes perfect so i'm gonna go ahead and get it down i'm gonna try first gear first you know what i mean see if we can get it down about this spot down here straight down here is why i used to go around my four-wheeler when i had it a long time ago i had a four-wheeler my little brother had a little baby one little 90 cc predator you know four-wheeler and then my dad had one of them big joints i don't know what cc it was it was like i don't know like 1200 or something two strokes something crazy like that or maybe it was like 700 i don't know but anyway we used to ride we used to ride down here now they got like fake cameras up acting like they film you and all that and uh you know no trespassing da -da -da -da. i mean i guess you could still technically go back there but i ain't gonna risk it look at this look at that joint down there yo y'all see that that's the military uh practice area they be flying helicopters over top of my head all the time oh you know what i think that is for real I think they're taking water to the fire. There's a fire somewhere around here. I don't know where it's at exactly, but it was like a lot of smoke in the air. A couple of uh, days ago. I think that might be good. Look like they got a big old bucket of water or something. Let's say this practice. Dropping care packages, I don't know. Anyway. There we 
go. Oh, shoot. <laughs> Woo. Oh, man, I keep on going off and I got to learn how to steer this joint while I'm, while I'm standing up. Woo. I'm going to flip backwards on that one. Getting there, though. We getting there. Try to hit a little tap dance while I'm up there, y'all. Hold up. <laughs> Hold up now. I don't think I'm agile enough to do that yet. I'm still way too much. <laughs> a little bit. <laughs> Alright, y'all. I'm gonna do like three or four more up and downs with this joint. And then I'm gonna shut it on down. I got a lot I gotta do today, you know what I mean? And it's hot outside too, yo. It's cloudy, but it's hot. It's at least 100. Hold on, let me see. Yesterday it was like 115. Yes, yeah, 100 degrees. 101. Anyway, let's go ahead and do a couple more of these, and then we're gonna pack it on up, y'all. down so y'all can see a little bit better there you go i don't know if it's angled up too high or not i'm hella shot but still getting busy maneuvering over there yeah i think they're just practicing what they doing all right let's do one more y'all we're gonna pack it on up here y'all from on the seat knee on the seat to both feet on the seat hold up that wasn't it all right i would say mission semi-accomplished for today y'all i got that really damn good a little bit better than i had it before I cut a lot of clips out. Let me ride. I ain't, you know, put anything in there. Cause I don't want the video to be no hour and a half long. You know what I mean? Let's see if we got it.